ओके नाउ कमिंग टू क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्सटीन इन अ सर्टेन कोड लैंग्वेज इंग्लिश इज रिटन एज एफ पी जे एल एच क्यू ई देन हाउ विल प्रजेंट बी रिटर्न इन दैट लैंग्वेज सो वॉट वी आर डूइंग हेयर सी फ्रॉम ई वी आर एडिंग वन इट विल बिकम एफ फ्रॉम एन we will add two so n then o then p okay it will be p from g we are adding three then g h i n j it will be j similarly l will be as it is so sorry not similarly l will be as it is we will not change we are not changing l And now what we are doing subtracting one from i we are subtracting one then we will get h means we are going back one step back earlier we are going one step forward then two then three step forward now we are going backward then one then two step backward we will get q three step backward we will get e so in this way the code in coding has been done now what we have to find we have to find out the coding for this present in the same coding language how will be the present written so adding 1 i will get q adding 2 in the r i will get t adding 3 in e i will get h as will be as it is now subtracting 1 i will get d or going backward one step from e we will get d in the alphabetical series similarly two step back from n i will get l three step from t i will get q so q t h s d l q will be our correct answer and you can see this is option b q t h s d l q okay now moving further to next question that is question number 18 here if if paper means wood wood means straw straw means grass grass means rubber and rubber means cloth so these are the coding it doesn't mean that paper means wood and so on so just we are doing a coding now the question is then by which furniture is made up of so furniture is made up of wood so wood means what straw so what we will mark we will mark as option b correct answer will be option b because furniture is made up of wood and wood means straw now moving further to the next question next question we are taking that is question number 20 in a certain code language result is coded as sdt tms so what we are doing here we are just adding one step or moving one step from r so we will get s then subtracting one from e plus one from r is it is as Minus one from E, it is D, and plus one again from S, it is T. Minus one from U, it is T. Plus one from L, it is M. And after L, M. Minus one from S, uh, minus one from T is S. So this is the coding. Plus one, minus one, plus one, minus one. Coding is going on. Okay, now here. then how will punish be coded now we have to code punish in the same way so what we will do plus 1 minus 1 then plus 1 then minus 1 then plus 1 then minus 1 this we have to do so from plus 1 uh, p2 plus 1 that is q we will get q from u minus 1 we will get t from n minus 
n plus 1 we will get o and i minus 1 I will get h similarly I will get t and I will get g from h minus 1 so qto htg will be our correct answer for the question number 20 and option b will be the correct answer okay now moving further to the next question that is question number 22 here mississippi is coded as l e r r e r r e o e so let us check how this mississippi is coded as before solving that first you should know what are the vowels you might be knowing vowels are a e i o u okay so here at the place of each of the vowel its previous vowel is written for example at the place of i we will write e here also we will write e here also e and here also we are writing e so at the place of vowel we will write its previous vowel for example e is the previous vowel of i okay so and what we are doing we are writing the previous letter of each of the letter so one step back from m will be l so and from r uh, from s we will have r rr will be here same again rr then one step back of p will be o and this will be the coding we are doing in this question so in the same code language how this olympic will be coded so o is also a vowel so before o what what comes i comes okay so before l what comes k comes before l x comes before m o comes and uh, sorry l comes before p what comes o and before i what which vowel come e vowel come and at the last we will be having b so i k x l o e b will be our correct answer and option b will be the correct option for the question